The big theory is that Doki Doki Literature Club and its upcoming game, Project Libertina, are both simulations run by a company. Well, it turns out Doki Doki Literature Club Plus has given us info on to what this company is and its name and also some of its members. Doki Doki Literature Club's Portrait of Markov book is literally a book about human trafficking and also simulated simulations and human trafficking involved with that. Something called Project Libertino, which is apparently also a website detailing an experiment on a girl to get her to open her third eye and gain military-like powers. It took Monica, let's just say a couple more years than 2018, she miscalculated, to become a fucking hero. She, uh, basically broke out of the simulation and possessed one of the workers over at the simulation house or whatever you want to call this company. And now is trying to save her friends in the second game, or second simulated universe, or VM. Virtual machine is how these companies call it. And she's gonna be a fucking hero, so... Project Libertina maybe soon? The company shown in DDLC Plus is, uh... PC, uh, basically, UI and secret mail, uh, lore shit is named Metaverse Enterprise Solutions. Even recently, uh, it has been discovered that there is a website tied to this organization. Yes, because the, um, definitive, uh, let's just say copy or hard copy of the, of the, this game, uh, basically like an anniversarial, I don't know, version of the game. DDLC Plus, came with a business card with a website on it. These simulated universes that Metaverse is working on secretly are actually known as VM, or Virtual Machine. VM1 being basically DDLC's main universe, the first game, Doki Doki Literature Club Plus's side stories being a massive government-like cover-up to Monica's basically abusing her elevated access power given to her by the simulation users or the metaverse because they wanted to uh, test what emotions she would feel if she was like put under this oh, self-aware state of mind. And it turns out they call this Monitor Kernel Access which is short for Monica, or long for Monica, I, I really don't know. These side stories literally cover up everything Monica did and make her unelevated with access and make her play piano and shit with no sight of NPC, aka you, the player. SVM is a secret side story that you can unlock in Doki Doki Literature Club Plus to test out, uh, basically test VM2 since VM2 is barely being worked on right now, apparently, and they're moving on and moving forward to Project Libertina. This test simulation is spitting out random, I don't know, glitchy code shit, with some English mixed in there, but you, 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 uh, you gotta realize that test VM2 or VM2 Project Libertina, I bet isn't even being worked on right now. So we just gotta wait until Dan Salato behind the scenes uh, gives us an update on the game, or if there is even going to be a game. Um, I will cover it on the channel, but before that, and after the DLC Plus, uh, basically full playthrough is over with. Um, gonna gonna stick to mods, yeah. I'm playing a lot of. We're gonna be playing a lot of mods. Request your DLC mods in the comments if you want to. I don't know.